All right, man. I seen this uh, photo come across my screen on social media. Joelle Santana, uh, girlfriend and wife, posted this uh, the picture to the right. I guess the other picture on social media. And it got the internet buzzing. And uh, it's Joelle Santana in jail. Booed up <laughs> in my LMA voice. But uh, let's talk about it. We've had good for the sports TV. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, bell icon button. Won't miss another video. Appreciate the love and support for real, man. Keep sharing the videos. And um, apparently, uh, Jewel Santana, I think he went to jail for the whole situation where uh, he might have a gun or some drugs in his luggage when he went to the airport and he fled and, you know, whatever that situation was about. And um, this picture on the right surfaced around the internet. His girlfriend posted it. And I wanted to repost that one. I don't know why he sent that one. And when you're in jail, Especially in the social media era where everybody thinks they know what go down in jail from watching Eyes and the Wire, lockdown, stuff of that nature. And, um, you know, old boy, you know, got his arm wrapped around Joel Santana. They both got Tim boots on, Timberlands, you can't tell, in, in the jail. And um, it looked like that's, you know, Joel Santana, his little, his little bitch, you know what I'm saying, his girl. And it may not even be like that, bro. You know, at the end of the day... You know, maybe they just cool, but uh, that's the last pose I'm taking in prison. I mean, I'm not even taking that pose if I'm in a club and I'm striking the pose with the homeboys. You got the rose bottle. Nah, bruh, don't put your arm around me, bruh. You know what I'm saying? But, um, you know, most people thinking that uh, Joel Santana getting them cheeks bust in jail. You know, it's a totally different animal. You know, you go out there and, you know, you rapping on these records like you gangster and you moving shit and you popping shit, but you... You know, in actuality, that's just a persona. It's not real deal. You know, you go back to straight out of Compton. I've been making a few movie references in this video on my last one. And um, they called Easy into the studio. Suge, he said, you're going to sign Dre and DLC over to me. And he said, Easy, like, you, you, uh, you stupider than, you, than I thought you was. He And he punched, and he got punched by one of the goons and shit. He said, and he started talking shit. He said, you, you can talk all tough you want to. This ain't no rap record. This real shit right here, you know where you at? It's Bompton, nigga. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, a lot of people think these rappers really got this tough persona, man. But, you know, studio studio gangsters been along, uh, been alive or been around in rap, you know, since the very beginning. Guys talking about they popping shit and how they killing shit, and it really don't be. They be talking about, like, they be talking about Gusto. And they be doing the Chris Rock. You know what I'm saying? CB4, but it, it could mean nothing. I hope we don't mean nothing, man. Joel Santana was uh, was one of my guys, especially I was just talking about with the gang's been missing this album he dropped, man. As teenagers, man, that that was real indicative of, uh, you know, uh, of our teenage years. That's one of those staples, man. You know, direct the Carter 1, Carter 2, and then What's the Game Been Missing? And uh, Come Home, well, uh, Cameron, Come Home With Me. All, all different types of shit that been going around, but you know, at the end of the day, people are going to speculate and say Joel, Joel Santana getting them cheeks busted busted open in jail. And that may not even be the situation. Maybe this is the pose. Just the pose they just took. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't want to rationalize and jump to conclusions or nothing like that. But it is what it is, man. You know, they got another picture of them in there. All of them sitting there as well in jail and shit. He looked like he eating well. Looked like he ain't dying or starving. But in jail, you know, it's pretty much, you know, it's really split up into cliques. You know what I'm saying? He can't run in there solo, especially, you know, he had a celebrity name and people think he worth money and might be trying to take him out the game. So let me know what y'all think in the comment section. Y'all think he uh getting them cheek busted? I don't think Jewels is, man. You know, maybe more of a protection thing. Maybe he got his arm wrapped around him saying, I got you. You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to let nobody touch you. But hey, it is what it is. Jail different, man. You can rap all you want to. Like should say, you can talk tough all you want to on Strata of Compton. This ain't no rap record, nigga. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, it's crazy that she posted this. I wouldn't even have posted this, man. Maybe she didn't think shit of it, but you know the internet always reaching for something, bro. You know, maybe they have been standing next to each other side by side, shoulder touching, they would have made something of it, man. But uh, appreciate it, man. Let me know what you guys think. Don't forget, we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out to the email if need be. If you have a business question, inquiry, response, or video request, check out our Patreon. If you want to make a donation, that link's in the description. Intro, instrumental, all that information is in the description as well. And uh, just keep sharing the videos, man. It's the best way you can help out and check our music entertainment playlist out. And I'm going to do another video about a rapper as well after this. So be pay attention. One time for the one time. We gone.